Today's video we're going to go through some exercises to help you reduce your runner's knee pain. So anterior knee pain, front of the knee, if you're getting some niggly uh, issues with that, or to help you stop getting that, these are exercises that can be really helpful. So, first thing we can do is a little bit of foam roller work. So if you get yourself a foam roller, um, these are really, really useful. Things that you can do on this is just a little bit of a massage of the lower body before you go for a workout, before you go for do any of your strength training or go for a run. So simply with this, we would go on the calves, so we roll up and down on the calf. You can move your hands forward to back depending on where you want to get into in the calf. Then we can also go onto the front, the thigh, and work that front of the thigh outside of the thigh, so we can work on the outside. Change side to do that on both sides, obviously. And you can also work on the adductors, so just coming more of a, a diagonal angle and getting into those adductors as well. Okay, so very simply, we've worked on calves, thigh, outside of the thigh, adductors. Can also do the glutes to be fair as well. So just into this position of working those glutes. Spend about 30 seconds to a minute on each area, um, and that's your foam rolling done. Then we want to work a couple of things. Firstly, hip extension, so the ability to really extend those hips. <clears throat> a lot of people will talk about the cue of leaving the foot behind you as you run and that creates less tension through the knee. So we want to have good flexible hip flexors and also quads. Okay, so uh, this one what I would do is come against the wall. I've done this one before on the channel. Uh, Rep fem stretch, so we're in this position, squeezing the bum, nice big stretch through here and just really leaning forwards into that stretch, maintaining a nice upright chest, and then come back and repeat so that we're really stretching out through that thigh, okay? You can get something underneath the knee, a cushion or a pillow, just so that you're not um, pressing the kneecap into the floor, especially if you've got knee pain, that might not be very comfortable. So, stretching out the thigh, so foam roller first, then get that stretch, that thigh stretched out nice and um, fluidly, and then we're gonna work a little bit on our strength. So. If you grab one of the bands, love this monster walk exercise. So we're in this position, okay. gap between the feet, and then we do what's called a crab walk. Okay. You can do two to three reps each way, and then I'll just repeat that and do 45 seconds to a minute till you really feel that burning through your glutes. Okay. And then the next one we're going to do is a single leg bridge. So we're going to come down into a lying position. One knee off the floor, hands by your side, and then we're just going to push up towards the ceiling, back down again. Make sure I'm squeezing this glute all the time. That's good. And then you do eight to ten on one side, eight to ten on the other side. So we foam roll the legs, we stretch out the thighs, and we straighten the glutes. If you do that little circuit, it will be really helpful for knee pain. Obviously, depending on what type of knee pain you have, you may need to be uh, fully assessed by a healthcare professional. But these are some things that you can hopefully do that will reduce your pain without necessarily needing to go and see someone, or will prevent you from getting that pain. If you want any more in-depth questions or if you want anything answered, then please get in touch with the comments or, or let me know um, via email. I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. If you did, then uh, please give us a like and uh, subscribe by clicking up here. Also, don't forget to go over to strengthphysio.com and check out our members area, which has basically got our full library of all of our videos. You can get there by going to strengthphysio.com forward slash members. Hopefully, I'll see you on the site and I'll talk to you all soon.